I am Anil Kumar and we will understand how to solve an equation involving fractions. Our strategy here is 1 to find the lowest common denominator and then 7 second multiply both sides by the lowest common denominator. In doing so, we'll get rid of fractions and then we'll have a linear equation without fractions to solve. It'll be easier for us, right? So let us see what is the lowest common denominator. The numbers here are 4, 2 and 5, right? So the lowest common denominator for these numbers is 4 times 5 is 20. 5 is a prime number, so we don't have much option. So 20 is also a common factor or a multiple of 2. So 20 becomes the lowest common denominator for us. So the equation here was x minus 3 over 4. We can multiply this by 20, right, to get rid of the denominator. Minus 2, we can multiply this by 20. We have to multiply each and every term by 20. Equals to, we have 3x over 2, we have to multiply this by 20 plus 2x plus 1 over 5, we have to multiply this by 20 also, right? So we have multiplied each term by 20. Now when we do so, then we can simplify them. So 20 is 4 times. Remember, you have to multiply 4 with both the terms on the numerator. Now this 20 will go 10 times. Now here we had 1 in the denominator, but this 20 can be divided by 4, it goes 5 times. And you need to multiply both the terms by 5. At this stage, what we have is x minus 3 times 5 minus 2 times 20 equals to 3x times 10 plus 2x plus 1 times 4, right? Now you can expand using distributive property. So when we say distributive property, the number outside gets multiplied with both the numbers inside. So that is important. Don't just multiply by one of them. 5 times x is 5x. Minus 3 times 5 is minus 15. Minus 2 times 20 is 40 with minus sign. Here we get 30x. Then we have to multiply 4 with both the numbers. So we have 8x plus 4. At this stage, we can combine the like terms. So we have 5x minus 15 minus 40 is minus 55 equals to 30 plus 8 is 38x plus 4. Now we can bring the like terms on one side, right? So if I bring 38 here, I get 5x minus 38x equals to 55 on the right side with plus sign it becomes 55 plus 4. Correct? Let me solve the rest of the question on the right side of this page. So 5x minus 38x will give us negative 33x, right? Equals to 55 plus 4 is 59. So x is equals to 59 divided by minus sign minus 33. So that is the solution for x in this particular case, right? Now, this is multiple of 3. 9 plus 5 is 14. You cannot further simplify. So we have our answer as x is equals to minus 59 over 33. So that is the answer. I hope the steps are very clear. So the steps are find the lowest common denominator, multiply all the terms by lowest common denominator so that you get rid of the fraction part and then you solve the equation like a normal linear equation. Thank you.